Thank you. Thank you guys so much. Enough, enough. I haven't done anything yet. I am Jonathan Root. I have a big mustache. Uh, it's, I know, and you're probably wondering, is it real? Yes, it is real. Uh, Texas, everything's bigger. Um, it's not my fault it's so big. Um, that's, that's, that's what she said. No, just, that was, didn't even make sense, but that's okay. Um, I accidentally used Brogaine. <laughs> Some men use Rogaine, I use Brogaine. Nothing, okay, thanks. <laughs> Good times. No, I, it was uncut Brogaine. I said uncut when I was speaking about the mustache. Come on, people, stay with the group. Th thank you. Thank you, my friend. Can you spread out, Russ, and make it sound like a crowd out there? It's good times. Thanks. I only have, I only have 15 minutes, Russ. All right, buddy. I'm just kidding. Um, there are certain disadvantages to having a huge mustache. Uh, when you go to the buffet, they say, one at a time. <laughs> Some people have bad hair days. I have bad face days. It, uh, sometimes it just goes up my nose and it makes me look like a special needs kid <laughs> or a cocaine addict. It's, neither of them is good. There's certain things you can't do with a mustache. You can't go swimming because your mustache absorbs all the water. So much for the Great Lakes. <laughs> Kids are like, oh, your mustache absorbed all the fun. Aww. I like Texas. It's good. I mean, the Dallas airport has its own zip code. Yeah. Big deal. <laughs> My mustache has its own area code. <laughs> good times. Uh, I do like Texas. I've been here for a little less than a year now. My only beef with Texas is that I've been pulled over twice since I've been here for excessive manliness. <laughs> it's okay, my mustache let him off with a warning. <laughs> I'll show you guys some fun stuff tonight. Just do the uh, comedy to warm you up. Oh my. <laughs> Giggity. Thank you. Someone just found religion. They said, Jesus Christ. <laughs> it's good times, just as long as you lose it by the time you leave. That's all I say. I'm going to have someone help me out here. This is my friend Scott. They asked, they asked that uh, I use someone I know so they don't sue again. Um, Scott, <laughs> Scott, if you can show them what you normally do. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, that would be, that would be, Scott, if you, Scott, Scott, I am going to, all I'm going to ask you to do is go like this, spin this around. We're going to try something. I'm going to have you back up just a step there. This would be awesome. Oh my gosh. I almost forgot. Hold on. Wait, wait, Scott. I got to get safety goggles for myself. Yeah. It's going to be awesome. All right. Whoa, 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 a little slower, a little slower. It worked, I'm so surprised. One sheet at a time. Okay, by request. Thank you. That last one was by the power of my mind. <laughs> Scott, you're not quite done yet. You did a really good job. You know, the whip is traveling at over 780 miles an hour. What you guys hear is a miniature sonic boom. But cutting toilet paper with a whip is a little bit of overkill. So we're going to try something a little awkward tonight. Check this out. Okay, <laughs> Scott, I'm going to have you hold this. Okay. <laughs> This, this is your power. You want to put it down to two. Don't mess with this one. That's just heat. Okay. <laughs> just give me a second. Okay. I have made my own custom whip. It's just a towel <laughs> that I wrapped together. I tied it here so it wouldn't come apart. 
All right, Scott, full blast, buddy. Scott, these are the things that keep me awake at night, man. <laughs> this is, seriously, this is what I think of when I'm trying to sleep. It's like, damn it, I must make one of these. <laughs> Give it up for Scott, he was awesome. I didn't realize how much of a mess I was going to make on my first bit, but that's okay. Thank you so much. About 70 years ago, there was a boxer. He broke his nose and through a series of medical procedures, he realized through the tubes that they were sticking in his head that your sinus does not go up into your head like most people think. It actually goes straight back. And so he invented a trick called blockhead where he stuck a nail into his nose. I would like to, to show you what I think is a brand new version on Blockhead. I'll show you what I'm talking about. I hit something back there. <laughs> Hold on. It's not, now that's not the best part. Oh, this is the best part. <laughs> Spin, damn it, spin. The mustache is in the way. It's true, man. The mustache is never in the way. Okay, you know what, damn it? I have a reserved one in case that one didn't work. I didn't want to do this again, but that's okay. That's what open stage is about, folks. Oh, that one was so much smoother. Oh, my gosh. Damn that spin! He's the air fryer. He's the hair. That would be fun. There we go. Hold on. There we go. That's how I get the sheen on my mustache. Everything's bigger in Texas. I have nothing funny to say, it just, it's big. <laughs> What's that? That's for cooking small burgers. It's for cooking small burgers? <laughs> it's a theme, folks, big. I get it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Now it's a party. I do have one more. Yeah. I will need someone to help me out. Look at, look at this. People are like, avoid eye contact with mustache man. <laughs> look at that. As soon as I said that, people are like, oh no. They're like praying, going to church and stuff. Yeah. Your... Look at this. Nice nose ring. I have a nose ring too. See, it's hidden. Awesome. I can do that too. Thanks. Cool. You can help me out tonight? Sure. Come on up here. What is your name? Dizzy. Dizzy? 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 Lizzie, I'm sorry. Lizzie, I'm going to have you stand right over here. All right, this is going to be awesome if I can figure out the configuration that I have. All right, let's see. Uh, nope. These were color-coded earlier. <laughs> I promised they were. All right, let's see. This is going to be fun. Ooh, you did not wear very much. That is awesome. <laughs> uh, makes it a total bonus for me. All right, let's see here. All right. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> she said, I'm pretty light. I might go up in the air. You see, these aren't helium balloons. That's okay, though. <laughs> it's, it's, it's okay. Maybe you hold that one in that hand. 
you're probably wondering at this point what you're going to be doing. <laughs> I'm wondering myself, too, if this is going to work. If you can just do this for me. Here we go. Oh, there we go. Whoa, my goodness. All right, hold on. Let's do it like this. Yeah, okay. This is going to be fantastic. This is the blowgun. This is going to be my good on the camera. All right, you want to hold those out like that. Give me maximum target. This is going to be totally fun. Wow, mustache got in the way. These are the things I do for fun. Okay, all right. Sorry, I'm sorry. That was not appropriate, okay? That'll make much more sense to you when you see the video, okay? These people are bastards. They didn't even try to stop me. It is amazing how a thin layer of latex can protect you. You guys are like rediscovering that joke. That's, it got like three different laughs. It was like people laughed and then they explained it to their friends and they laughed and then people are still, bro, you're still getting the bro game joke. In Mexico, I'm Mr. Whiskers. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You have been so brave and so strong. Here we go. Give it up for our volunteer. She was fantastic. You were awesome. Thank you so much for helping me. Keep it going for my volunteer. She was fantastic. Hey guys, I'm Jonathan Root. Uh, I'm on Facebook, Twitter, and all that stuff. Also follow the open stage if you guys haven't. Thank you for having me open stage. Have a great night. Bye-bye, guys. Thanks.